it's Christmas Eve and we're in the shops doing our last minute food shopping, as is tradition. <laughs> well, there's a severe lack of cakes. <laughs> no cakes for Christmas. No cakes for Christmas. You've got a toffee pavlova and a toffee cheesecake. Yeah, popular, aren't they? People don't like toffee. <laughs> Tartar citro. I don't even know what that means. Is, isn't that a car? A Tartar citro. <laughs> I don't know. White chocolate and passion fruit. I think you're losing <laughs> your voice, aren't you? I am really losing my voice. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a very quiet Christmas. Right, well, we've done the food shopping. Now I'm rushing into town to get some wrapping paper because we've run out and I haven't even started wrapping the presents yet. So, yay! There we go, I've got 15 metres of wrapping paper. If that doesn't cover it, I don't know what will. So there we go, my parents' presents all nicely wrapped. I've done something special to this one for my mother, uh, which you'll get to see tomorrow. Um, yeah, it's a surprise and I don't think she's going to expect it. Look at her, she's like Mrs. Claus. With all these presents. So many presents for so many people. Stop, you'll see them on here. He's a very happy Buddha. What's he so happy about? Oh, right, I see. I see how it is. Well, this is all looking very Christmassy. What are you, what are you doing? What's going on? Let's look through the curtain. What's through the square window? Oh. I can't see. <laughs> oh dear. Well, that's it for today. It is the night before Christmas, and all that is left is to go to bed and wait for Santa Claus to arrive with the presents and things for, well, just me tomorrow. It's not, my brother's not here. Just me and the rents for the whole day. So, uh, yes, he's wishing you a Merry Christmas, and I will see you. Tomorrow night.